Welcome to this episode of Tax Drawing Off Road Garage. I'm Ashley Helton and this is the all new Stampede 900. Today we're going to learn how to properly purge the cooling system. We need to do this anytime the system's been drained. Before we begin the Stampede cooling system purge procedure, we're going to need to gather a few things. We need some 50 50 antifreeze, a screwdriver, and a one gallon bucket. Anytime the cooling system is drained on the Stampede, we need to purge the system. The reason why we jacked the front of the stampede up is to allow air bubbles and air pockets to travel up through the cooling system from the crankcase through the cooling lines to the top portion of the radiator. Begin the cooling system purge by removing the overflow line at the top of the radiator. I'm going to route the overflow line to a bucket that's underneath the stampede. Now add your 50-50 coolant through the radiator cap opening. You'll know that the system is purged when the water coming out of the overflow is nice and clear. Now reattach the overflow hose to the top of the radiator. All right, let's go ahead and top off the radiator now that the overflow hose is connected. The next thing to do is go ahead and install the radiator cap and fire up the vehicle. All right, folks, this is one of the most important steps. Now we need to crank up the stampede and let it run to 2200 RPM for approximately 15 to 20 seconds. This will allow the water pump to build pressure and push any additional air out of the system. Now that all the air has been purged out of the system, the fluid level dropped down in the radiator. So now we just need to correct that level using our 50-50 antifreeze. And don't forget to correct it also in the reservoir. Well, that about wraps us up for today. Don't forget to check us out on YouTube. And as always, don't forget your owner's guide and service manual information for additional tips. We'll see you next time.